Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to add a submit button to the form. Um, clicking the submit button will send the data from your form to the URL you specified in the actions attribute. So that means that it will send the data from the form, which means here, to the page that you specified here to the action, right? Okay, great. Um, let's add a submit button at the last element of the form. Um, with a type of submit. So we're going to go down here. We're going to do uh, button and then the type will be equal to submit. With the buttons, we always want to close the button as well. It's not like the image tag, which is a self-closing image, uh, which is a self-closing tag with the button we want to add it here. Now you notice the button popped up here, but it doesn't look great because there's no text in it. So in the text of the button, um, we might as well add something. Here it says your submit um, button should only have the text submit. So if we just uh, go submit, then we'll see that it popped up right there. We might as well make it capitalized to make it proper. And as you can see, it's inside of the form. So there's the form elements, which are here. And then there's the input element, which is a self-closing element. And then there's the button element. And so now we have a form, which is made up of this input and then this submit button. Let's run the test and see if it passes. It worked. Thanks for watching. See you in the next lesson.